Technically, the number one is the made of the Oh, Christians don't know math, please. Christians don't know math. You don't know math. Don't speak about math. It tells you that Allah made the world in first eight days, in seven days, and then the further, there's a hadith that says Allah made the world in six days. So your God can count. Bro. Your God doesn't know what eight, seven, and how six is. Trees? How, how many trees? is that? How many trees? Uh, all, all I see over there is Allah how because many, Allah is a tree. That's what I see. You, it, the Quran how many says. Heads? How many the Quran heads? says. Three and one. You look to the east. You look to the west. And what do you see? The face of Allah. Bro, so Allah has a face in the east the and a face in the west. The Quran, so Allah has multiple faces. One in the east and one in the west. My friend, how many faces does Allah have? How many? Because he has one in the east and the west. Allah has at least two faces. There you go. Muslims can't count either. Who's next? Who's next? Who wants with David? Alright, cool, whatever. Alright. Yo, come over here. Come over here. Come. Get over here. Get over here. Get over here. You're my girlfriend. Get over here. Honey, 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 get over here, honey. Honey, get over here. Come ask me a question. You wanted to ask me a question before. Are you scared now? Are you afraid? Okay. Live in fear. If you ever want to come out of fear, embrace Christ. Because Christ says that he has not given you a spirit of fear. No. When you're tired of being scared, leave Muhammad behind and come to Jesus Christ. Let's go. My friends, do any of you have any questions about Christianity? Anybody? Anybody? Any question at all, I'll answer it for you. How did you do this tag? Are you going to accept it? Sorry? Get over here. What's up? Okay, very simple. Jesus, Jesus hung himself, right? Now, don't worry about Soko. Oh, come on now, my Muslims. My Muslims. My Muslims. Has Allah told you to be afraid of a camera? Did Allah tell you to run from cameras? Simple, he didn't. You're turning red, so you're all stressed, not me. Anyway, Allah never told you, Allah never told you to run from cameras. So please, Muslims, come talk to me. All right, they don't want to. Easy, that's fine. Ultimately, people, I am here amongst the Muslims, and none want to talk to me. Why? Because they're afraid. Their God cannot count. Their God in the Quran says that he made the world in eight or seven days. What was that happening, sorry? Yeah, what's happening? What do you want? And ask, ask away, what do you want? No, but you're doing it for the camera. What do you want? Ask away. Let me tell you this. My friends, I don't know who you are, but I care about you. You know why? You don't know who I am. Yeah, I don't know who you are, but I care about you. You know why? But I care about you. No, I, I didn't say that. No, you said you know I said I don't know who you are. But I care about you. It's time for you to laugh now. You can laugh. That was actually kind of funny. Right, there you go. So, But I care about you. You know why? You know why? Because you're a human being. And I believe that you are made in the image of God. Allah even says that he made Allah in his image. Okay? So you have value. Right? Now, I absolutely accept that you're a pious Muslim. You, you follow the, 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 the five pillars and the six articles of faith. That, that's, that's good for you. Okay? But I think, according to Christ, that wait, wait, you're following the wrong way. Do you think, by, when you're talking to somebody, it's yes. good to point at that? If you don't like it, I won't do it again. All right? no, do you think that's appropriate? I, I, I don't mind. Okay? Do you mind? I do. Okay, I won't do it again. So, so very simple. Okay? But you're following the wrong God. That's the issue. Right? You're not following the correct one. The only way, truth and life is Jesus Christ. So if you believe that Isa was sinless, a pure boy and not a liar, what I'll say to you? Allah says to me, Lakum dinukum. Sorry, I only do English. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you. You have your religion, I have mine, right? Okay, wait. If you believe that, you wait. believe that. I believe this religion is that good doesn't for me work for me. Okay, no, it's worked for you on the physical plane. That's fine. It has taught you discipline. A routine a companionship that's fine unfortunately though your immortal soul is at risk because yeah exactly so what I am charged to do is tell you that you of your own self you of your own self have no ability to attain salvation just based on what you do wait but Allah has given you mercy Right? And I am telling you that that mercy is Jesus Christ. You don't have to tell me that Muhammad told me already. Allah to, so Muhammad told you that Isa is a mercy to you. No, no, no. Well, that's why I said. Well, 
If Allah is merciful to you, can you explain to me why in Surah 43? I don't need to explain anything to you. Why Allah tells you that if you forget him, he will send demons to you to be your comrades and then guide you away from him. Okay, then I will make sure that I don't forget him. Okay, wait. But if Allah is merciful, how does it befit a merciful God to send demons to guide you away from him because you forgot him? Maybe he's just telling me don't forget me, so I won't. But wait, how is he merciful then? He is merciful because he's not making me forget. But he is because he will he send demons no, to you. He didn't, he didn't. Do you want to read it? You could well be the only you, demon here. Do you want to read it? I could well be walking away from you right now. Do you want to read it? I don't need to because you just told me and I believe what you said. Okay. But I am telling you that a merciful God would not send demons after you to make you ghost away further from him. Instead, he would draw you, you are the demon he would draw you nearer what to him. What if I believe you are the demon? In Islamic theology, demons are not human beings. They are creatures of, of smokeless fire. I can touch you. I'm human, no, so I can be a demon. No, 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 okay, that's fine. Well, at least now you know. I can touch you. I'm a human being, so I can be a demon. There you go. Simple. You just never know. You may be a follower of a demon. Maybe you have okay. demons inside you that okay. try to well, take me away from my Okay, demon. listen to me carefully. I follow Christ, right? Now, Christ said, right, that a house divided against itself cannot stand. So if I am following a demon and I'm coming here to preach salvation to you, I am going against what demons want. Then don't. Then follow so, no, no, no. By, by me preaching the gospel to you, that means I can't I can follow the demon. No, understand. Let me say it again. Let me say it again slowly. Because unless you believe that Isa and his followers, who Allah in the Quran even says, Isa and his followers, according to Allah in the Quran, will be superior until the days of judgment. I like keeping this. That's fine. Isa and his followers. Who are his followers? It's not you guys, it's us. So even Allah tells you that we will be superior well to the day of judgment. So why don't you also come and be superior as well? I am. I feel superior because I have. But the Quran doesn't tell you this. The Quran never says that having Allah in your heart makes you superior. The Quran says that following Isa makes you superior. Who says that? The Quran says this. Isa and his followers will be superior until the day of judgment. So I call you to follow Isa. I follow Muhammad the, father, the last messenger. But technically, Muhammad isn't the last because you believe that Isa will come back in a ball of Jizya. Yeah, 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 but so wait. The follower of Muhammad as well. But he can't be because he. Okay. He will not bring no law. But he will. He will. He will abolish Jizya and he will slay the pigs. Why? Because he is bringing a new law. He is changing the Sharia. Let's just hope. So we that means. By then to see what happens. But that would mean that you're following the wrong person. Muhammad isn't going to get you to heaven. Uh, Muhammad himself doesn't even know where he's going. I'd like to take that risk. Really? Okay. In that case, listen, my friend. If, if God gave us free will, if of your own free will you have chosen to deny the Father and deny the Son because you prefer Muhammad and Allah, they are. Two people. Two people, absolutely. Two persons, absolutely. Yes. Two persons. Yeah, no, God is God. So, very simply, we believe that. The Son is Son. No, the, the Son is the Son of God, but it's also God. Son of God is also God. Simple, simple. We believe in the divine essence. For example, you're me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. let me explain it to you. God and Son. Okay. Two people but one person. You're confusing me. Okay. Should I explain? No. But why not? Because Allah says, Kulhu Allahu Ahad. Okay, wait. But Kulhu Allahu Ahad does not say that Allah is one person. It doesn't. Ahad. One. Well, one and only. Well, well, no, because that was well, that's a, what you believe. So listen, can you please show me where I it? Don't need to. No, where does it say that Allah is one person? It doesn't say that. Yeah, but Ahad does not mean one person. It does. It does Ahad not. Ahad means specifically one. Well, actually, Ahad can mean one and multiple of one. But in your interpretation, maybe in mine, so, one. So, for example, Ahad comes from Ihad, from, uh, from, from Hebrew. Because Find our... Out. Huh? Find out. I don't know. It does. Need to know. And, and, and even in Hebrew, um, Ahad can mean one individual or people joining together in a single unit. Okay. That's your belief? That's okay. your interpretation? So, Good luck. Even in the Quran, the word Ahad is used to describe things that are coming together. Right. Okay. Again, like now, said, that's your interpretation. in Arabic, which I believe you might speak or may not speak, uh, I'm not sure. Huh? I do not. But I do know. How can you quote something in Arabic when you don't even speak? For, for example, I don't speak French. Right. right? We're not but I, but, French. but no, listen very carefully. I don't speak French. Right. But I know what bonjour means. 
Okay? So, in the same way, I don't speak Arabic, but I know what Ahad means and what Wahid means. When you count in Arabic... That's what I'm saying. That's your interpretation of Ahad. This is factual. For you! When you count... When you count in Arabic, do you start with Ahad or Wahid? One and only. Okay, but when you count in Arabic... You don't understand what I'm saying, do you? Do you I hear, understand English? I hear what you're saying, right. okay? But I disagree with you. Because if you wanted well, you to call Allah, to no, very simply, if you wanted you to call Allah opinion. the one and only, you would call him Wahid. Because I believe in the Quran, he's also Allah called only, he's also called Wahid and Ahad. So why would Allah need you two words to describe the same thing? Think about it. Why is Allah describing himself as a singular digit, Wahid? You keep and coming close, bro. Distance. Why is Allah describing himself as a singular digit, Wahid, one, because but also only. Ahad, which can mean one, but also a, a, a one in a unity? Keep studying, keep studying. Maybe you come to a conclusion. So that tells me that Allah is one and only in position only, but Allah is not one person. He think? might be more than one person, or he think? might not even have a personality. Is that what you think? Because some of your schools, for example, the Athari, no, 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 the, no, no, the schools of Islam, the schools of Islam, your madhabs, for example. Right. Okay. Your schools of thought, right? I believe under the, the Hanbali madhab, you have the, the Atharis. Now the Atharis hold that Allah is all the Atharis. Google them. Don't worry, they, they exist. Okay. But that's fine. But listen. Listen very carefully. Your scholars have told you in the past, yes, that Allah is only pure will. Okay? Then Allah can then make for himself attributes to interact with humanity. Can and has. So for for example, there is a um there is a um a hadith that says that on the day I have on in the Arabic or English? In English only. Now, on the day that Allah made creation, He then also made mercy. He divided mercy into 99 pieces and sent one down to humanity. So whenever you see a person being kind to somebody... Okay, well it's there. Do you want me to show this to you? So you can go read it at home. That's fine. Ultimately, ultimately, listen very carefully. Your God can be quite confusing. Hold on. No, I'm not. I don't want, I don't want to make it confusing. Okay. Men came to a companion of the person. Okay. Abu Bakr Sadiq. Okay. And he gives a... When you qualify the statement. Tell me I'm a new one. When you qualify the statement. Because I'm a very simple man. Okay. Right. You said, I don't want you to don't make anything complicated myself. Oh, okay. Give me something simple. No, you can stay here. Five pillars of I'm Islamic faith. I'm just going to okay. stay here. He said, you know do what I have to, to do more? That's okay, man. This is enough. I'm not insincere. I gave you a basic answer, you just didn't yeah. like it. Mm -hmm. Alhamdulillah. If you don't like the answer, it's fine. A I lot see. of people don't like the right. answer I say. So you only want something I because it's simple. I gave you the answer that you gave a qualifier to your statement. No, because You couldn't answer the fact that you had to give a necessary qualifier to what you said. Okay. It gives me tranquility. But there are even simpler religions. They don't even require you to have five pillars. So because I, I don't didn't need accept to, your answer and actually critique that you have an issue. Me tranquility. For example, Please, Sufi. Sufism does this. Sufism. Yes. Okay. So once you become Sufi, it's easier than, than, than being a Sunni. That's my choice or your choice? I'm just saying, if you're saying that, that the... Uh, I've given you my choice right. already. But I, listen, mean, I don't want you if, to give me If the choice. benefit of Islam for you is that it's simple, there are much simpler things you could do. No, what I so, mean is simple enough for me. Okay, right. But you don't want it to be any more, any more simple, any more complicated. So you're, you're fine where you are. Alhamdulillah. Okay, so this is this is important, right? So the oh, criterion we Okay, use, we change it now? Uh, go ahead. Do you want to change it? Just fill me in on what's going on. I had a point to make just on the statement. It's your two discussions, but I think a necessary word may be implied. That's okay. So I talked to him about, about some, some hadith and some of, of the Quran. But he says that it is a hadith where a man came to Abu Bakr and told him he's a simple man. So what do I need to do to, be, to, to, to become a Muslim? And Abu Bakr gave him only the five pillars. Was a Muslim already? You wanted to make he's a Muslim already. Okay. I think the issue is this. I think. Oh, there's an issue. Yeah. Oh. Okay. You say there's an issue. Yeah. I see. If I may tell well, you, you need to well, substantiate I think you it. You need to go and get your issue solved. No, no. I think there's ah. an issue with your. Okay. You should say Lakum Dinu Kumaliyadi. 
Do you issues you yourself? I will deal with my issues. So you are happy accepting a system that has problems because the system you like? I believe it doesn't. You believe it does? Don't follow it. Okay, so I'm asking you to follow If I presented you the problems with the system that keeps people out of that system. But that will be your perception, not mine. Well, what if I showed that objectively it's a specific perception? That wherever not or not I exist, maybe the for you. Will be there. Again, no, no, no. I, I can die right now. The problem will always be there. If you die right now, yes. It so will then be. it's not my problem. It's a problem that exists over there that you have to for deal who? with. For who? For you as a follower. I believe in no problem for me. Yeah, you can believe um, what you want, but the problem will always exist. No problem to me. So it's not a problem that your theology that has problems exists? Doesn't have a problem according to my belief? Yeah, according to your conception. I'm saying no, my belief. Okay, okay. If you no conception. Die, yeah. Your conception but my you, belief. If you die, yeah. A belief is a conception that you adhere to. So if you, meaning that's your conception, if you die. No, no, no. My right belief. Now, okay, your conception. Okay, what's a belief? La ilaha illallah. There's only one. No, what is a belief? As in the term belief, define it. Well, you do. Why don't you define it? Because you're saying that there's a because you're saying that there's a distinction between you said that there's a distinction a difference between I never belief said no and distinction or distinction. so are beliefs and conceptions the same thing? No, you are saying about what I believe. I'm asking you if they're the same thing. Sorry? I'm asking you if they're the same thing. A belief and a conception are they the same thing? Belief is different to conception. Great. What's the difference? I could well be wrong. Conception is what you believe. I believe. No, 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 as, as in, as in the term conception. So we have this word conception, where and then we, we have this word belief. Where, where, where do you okay. want to go with this? I'm clarifying with something like this. So since if you don't want to answer the question that I've just like laid out for you, that's okay. Right, right. You already told us there's a difference between conception and belief. That's fine. I say that there's a, I say that, that, that's, that's great. That, that's completely fine. Neither am I. No one cares. Point is this. Oh, you do. I don't care if you're a scholar or not. I don't care if I'm a scholar or not either. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't care. Yeah. What are you here for? What? I don't need to be a scholar to be in the park. Okay, no, but that's what I'm saying. What are you here for? What am I here for? No. I'm here to clarify a point that you mm. made. Okay. Yeah, on I simplicity. Made a point that you're gonna clarify. Okay, clarify. Yeah, you made a point on simplicity. Okay, you said it's simple enough for you, and regardless of whether there are problems that are found in that, because there's no problems to you, mm. then you don't care. No. Those problems will still exist long after you're gone. Nothing to do with me? Right, so because the people existed thousand millions years before, yeah. problems were there. They still exist. Right, right. No, but we're talking about we're saying problems in your for belief that you have. They don't exist. No problem exists for me. Sure. So, for example, um, if someone that was a um, white nationalist said that um, you know I don't think black people exist, right? And I say there's a problem with that belief. He says there's no problem at all. I just believe it. Is that an issue to you? You say okay, well done to white nationalists that deny the existence of black people. Are you trying to put, get views on this? No, because this is not my channel. I don't own this. this I don't own that oh, channel. Are you talking to me or them? I took the mic because he gave it to me. But that's what I'm saying. You're talking to them or you're talking to me? I'm not talking to them. I don't know who they are. You just said good for them. That's their belief. Are you not going to critique that at all? Why should I? Why should you critique the fact that they Why believe black people don't exist? What are you screaming for? I'm screaming because as a black person, I think I, I, think I exist. I, I think you would agree? Yeah, but why are you shouting for? Do I think I'm shouting down? because of the passion of making sure that black people exist. I don't think there's an issue with that. And again, I can tone down my voice as well. Where you go with this from normal Islamic discussion to black people? Dude, I'm talking about the fact that you have to have problem. Dude, I'm talking about the fact that you have... Yeah, it's okay. I'm talking about the fact that you need to have beliefs, right? It's, it's okay. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Listen, listen, listen. Okay. Do you want me... Okay, do you want me to... Do you, oh, it's okay. Hold on. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You need to keep your voice It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're raising your voice now. No, because you're raising it. There you go. It's all right. Calm down. It's all right. So, please, okay. Oh, you want me to calm down and you I, start screaming? Because you, scream you said that you want me to be calm, so I'm now giving you charity. I'm, I'm giving you charity to, to be calm, so then there's that, right? Talk to yourself. All right, so it, it, here's the issue. Here's the issue. The no, reason why I bring, gave up the black example is to no, show to know. the, the reason why rubbish, like yourself, there are like reasons. Your Thank you for saying that I'm rubbish. But here's the thing. You have to have problems with beliefs that don't make sense. There has to be issues with beliefs that don't make sense. Dude. Arrogance. There's, there's no arrogance, right? You have to have problems with beliefs that don't make sense. What doesn't make right? sense? So, for example, the fact that he has some random dogmatism that forces him to not actually, you know, understand the statements that are being believed. So, if you don't have problems... Down, son. What do you think I just said? What, what did I just say? You said I'm because I'm black, I'm this, that, and the other. No, you start again well, that's, 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 not, said, that's not what I said. Okay. At all. We're, we're getting too far away from the point. Oh, hold, on. Okay. hold on, hold on, hold on. Look, look the po hold on, son. It's all right, We're man. talking, right? So, look. Hold on. 
we were talking, right? Maybe I just I want to clarify a point, right? So what are we talking? Yeah. The point okay. is this, But you don't need to clarify that with me, Sam. Because you're very rude. You you I haven't been, I haven't been rude. Do you mind you clarifying in the... Okay, you found, you found offence. That's okay. Sorry, my yeah. apologies. And my apologies, you found offence. Okay. Clarifying the rapper. Yeah, 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 so this is this, this is the clarification. Because you went from religion to black and white. No, no, no. I gave I gave a specific example. I gave a specific example. Yeah, the example is supposed to signify the fact that... If what you're looking for is the simplest means to an end goal. The simplest way for you to get into heaven is by following Jesus Christ. There's that no other simple way. Right? Yeah. That's okay? what you believe, right? So if you're about following what's simple, follow Jesus. How about why you follow what you believe is good and I follow what I believe to you be You have true. that option, but I care about you. So I'm just letting you Likewise, know. I care about you. Okay. So like my Allah says in so, Quran. So you, you care about me. So, but then by caring about me, you want me to follow something which you believe no. will wind me up in hell. No. So as a Christian, in your worldview, am I might go to heaven. If he Who am I to say that? Huh? Who am I to say that? Okay, so it could happen. So it's possible that Christian. What do the Bible say? The Bible said it's empty. If you don't believe in the crucifixion, you're doomed. No, but he's saying that in his worldview, I can go to heaven. In my worldview. He believes in his worldview. Yeah. Well, actually, we shouldn't it's, it's that. Islam. I'm asking if it's possible that he can go to heaven as a Christian. Because That's don't forget, point. you, you, you said you care about me, sure, sure. and you said you have your religion, I have mine. Now, if you care about me, are you caring about me by not telling me about Islam? I haven't got sufficient knowledge okay. to tell you. My knowledge is for me only. Okay. I'm happy with that. So, okay. But you care about me. No, no. Why would I care about you or not care about you? Do I know you? Okay. Okay, but I told you that I care about you. Yeah, yeah. So I'm telling you the gospel. David, if you take your shahada, there you go. Yeah. He knows more than and I do. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And you die on that, yep. shall I go to heaven? There you but go. If you die, if you die believing but in Jesus Lamin, is God, what happens? Came, a man came to die for your sin. But you Lamin, in that one, what happens you go when I take my shahada? I start working as a Muslim, but what Allah has written for me overtakes me. You don't have. Okay, Allah can help you and Muhammad can help you. Exactly. Okay? We'll see on the day. Gospel of Paul. And I pray to Allah. Gospel of Paul, not gospel of Jesus. I pray to Allah. David, you say. No, 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 listen, listen. Huh? Your name is David, right? David. Of Allah. We are this. Well, e e e everyone will be there. Huh? Everyone will be there. No, no, no. Uh -huh. We will be there, yes. Yeah. But we face each other. From the dead, and I will say on that day, David, I told you all you will say. Imran, I told you. No, no, no. I'll pray for that day. That we see each other on that day. So You've heard the gospel. I've done my job. May God bless you, and I hope that Christ touches your heart and you come to Him. And in return, you've heard everybody else. You've heard the brother. You have been given the choice to accept or not accept. Fair enough. But I've done my job. Likewise, okay. not myself, obviously, because I don't have the sufficient knowledge. But I'm sure my other brothers have done so. Okay. Fair enough. You have sufficient knowledge, and let's hope that we all end up end up in heaven. That would be nice, oh, but unfortunately, Christ was clear. He won't be there for you on that day. Because my prophet says, He's the only one who can. He's the only one who can. That's the only issue. But thank you, okay? Fair enough.